Hello, my name is Dr. Susan Coates, and I'm proud to serve as principal of Austin O'Brien Catholic Senior High School. On behalf of our, our entire staff, I would like to welcome you to the Austin O'Brien Awards Ceremony 2021. In particular, I would like to welcome all those associated with our school, namely our students, parents, friends, relatives, staff, presenters, and sponsors. Thank you for joining us to celebrate the successes of our AOB students during the 2021 school year. At this time, I would like to call upon Mr. Pandic to lead us in prayer, followed by the Treaty 6 Acknowledgement. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Gracious God, we ask your blessing upon these young students who we honour today for their achievements. We applaud their capacity for creativity, for critical thinking and for focused effort. We are grateful that they and their families entrusted all the staff at Austin O'Brien to engage them intellectually, moral, morally and spiritually. Thank you for their confidence in discovering and exploring new possibilities and knowledge, helping them discern what is right, good and just. Enable them to draw upon the wisdom and experience of yesterday as they respond to the questions and concerns of tomorrow. Support our honoured student leaders as they continue to make a difference in the world and lead a life for the greater glory of God. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. And now, I'd like to acknowledge that we are on the traditional land of Treaty 6 territory, a meeting grounds, gathering place, and traveling route to the Cree, Soto, Blackfoot, Métis, Dene, and Nakota Sioux. We acknowledge all the many First Nations, Métis, and Inuit, whose footsteps have marked these lands for centuries. This annual awards ceremony is among our most treasured occasions of the school year, as it provides us with an opportunity to reflect on the preceding year, address the whole community, and share the achievements of the students with their parents and families. AOB believes that good education plays a vital role in building a bright future for our children. Therefore, we are committed to providing an atmosphere to our students where they can learn new educational things every day, learn about teamwork, and also, most importantly, learn right from wrong. I am extremely glad at the fact that our school committee members, as well as teachers, are putting every effort to provide excellent opportunities for students to develop their academic, athletic, artistic, and moral talents and gifts. On this important occasion, we are proud to publicly celebrate the success achieved through the sheer hard work and perseverance of our students and the unfailing care and guidance of our teachers and staff. I express my heartfelt gratitude to the teachers and parents for their support and collective efforts towards the development of these young adults, providing formation to achieve something worthwhile in life. Whatever our students have achieved so far would never have been possible without your constant endeavor. I leave you with a quote from Pope John Paul II, the patron saint of Austin O'Brien Catholic High School, who continues to encourage our students. Dear young people, let yourselves be taken over by the light of Christ and spread that light wherever you are. Wishing our students my most sincere congratulations on their achievements. We now would like to call on Trustee Aline Mutella to send messages from the Edmonton Catholic Board of Trustees. Go ahead. Greetings, Principal Coates, Assistant Principals, dedicated staff, honored students, supportive family members, and friends. My name is Aline Mutella and I'm your trustee for Ward 75. I am absolutely delighted to bring you greetings on behalf of the Edmonton Catholic School Board of Trustees. 2020-21 has been an unprecedented year for all staff, students, and families. I know everyone has done their best to continue and with excellent student learning during this challenging time. I want to thank all staff, parents, and students for their patience and cooperation during the COVID pandemic. Today we are here to celebrate and honor our remarkable students who continuously strive for excellence 
within the four walls of our schools or by online at home. Our theme for Edmonton Catholic Schools this year is God Calls Us Each by Name. God has called each and every one of you to do the best you can, even during a COVID pandemic. You have proven that hard work, dedication and perseverance are the best strategies for success. Your commitment not only builds a stronger school community, but also inspires others to continually challenge themselves and to reach their goals. I want to take a moment to acknowledge all the staff who have worked tirelessly to help each student achieve their very best and made learning through Christ come alive in the classrooms of our beloved school and for the past year during in-class or online learning. We share in your pride and we feel for your resilient students. And to our parents and guardians, thank you for trusting Edmonton Catholic Schools to provide a faith-based education which inspires and prepares your children to learn, to work, and to live and serve God and one another. The Board of Trustees and I congratulate all the award winners of Austin O'Brien High School on their outstanding achievements and remarkable personal growth. I have no doubt that every one of you will excel in your future roles and I wish every one of you success. Congratulations and let us remember that God has called each by name. Thank you and enjoy your awards event. My name is Mrs. Tishka and I will present our English awards. The recipients for English awards are as follows. English 10-1, Lucas Schneider. English 10-1 AP, Amy Pacheco. English 10-2, Karen Garcia. And English 10-4, Austin Robinson. English 20-1, Evan Shavchuk. Uh, English 20-1 AP, Maeve McDougall. English 20-2, Randall Gumate. English 20-4, Jacob Reed. English 30-1, Irina Vasiluk. English 30-1 AP, Ryan Reichson. English 30-2, Jackson Parker. And English 30-4, Jaden Rogers. Congratulations on your English awards. My name is Mr. Smith, and I will now present the Mathematics Awards. The recipients for Math Awards are as follows. Math 10C, Andre Renew. Math 10C AP, Estelle Steffner. Math 10-3, Seychelle Adana Costantino. Math 10-4, Kaylin Fielding. And Austin Robinson. Math 20-1, Graham Baker Henderson. Math 20-2, Selena Fernandez. Math 20-3, Trayden Bird. Math 20-4, Polito Musiwa. Math 30-1, Larissa Hamilton and Evan Shavchuk. Math 30-1 AP, Graham Baker Henderson. Math 30-2, Ryan Reichson. Math 30-3, Andrea Zapata. Math 31 AP, Robert Basundat. And Lukian Podilski. Statistics 35 AP, Victoria Katsuba. Congratulations on your math awards. Hi, my name is Miss Fedora and I will now present the Science Awards. The Science Award recipients are Science 10, Joshua Dennis. Science 10 AP, Solomia Mick. Science 14, Kaylin Fielding. Science 20, Iosia Swinmu. Science 24, Marina Jimenez Guerrero. Science 30, Mateus Ferderer. My name is Ms. Johnson and I will now present the Biology Awards. The Biology Award recipients are for Biology 20, Casper Chaplowski. For Biology 20 AP, Emma Smith. For Biology 30, Sarah Clark. For Biology 30 AP, Maeve McDougall. And now I'll present the Chemistry Awards. The Chemistry Award recipients are Chemistry 20, Jack Letwin and Larissa Hamilton. Chemistry 30, Lukian Podilski. Congratulations. Yeah, that'll be My name is Mr. Turchansky, and I will now present the Physics Awards. The Physics Award recipients are Physics 20, Irina Basilic, uh, Physics 30, Irina Basilic, congratulations on your Science Awards. My name is Mr. McPherson, and I will now present the Social Studies Awards. The Social Studies recipients are Social Studies 10-1, Solomia Mitz. Social Studies 10-2, 
Jocelyn Schmidtke, Social Studies 10-4, Athena Frazier. Social Studies 20-1, Larissa Hamilton. Social Studies 20-2, Miguel Monreal. Social Studies 20-4, Jaden Rogers. Social Studies 30-1, Mateus Ferderer. And Social Studies 30-2, Annika Jones. Congratulations on your social awards. Hello, my name is Mrs. Sedeo Wazalenko. Um, my colleagues and I will be presenting the International Language Awards for uh, French, Spanish, Polish, and Ukrainian. I'll be presenting the French award first. So for our recipients for French 10 are Amy Pachenko, Andrea Santos, Ariel Cristina Nadala. For French 20, Roman Dudic, Sofia uh, Pekna, and for French 30, it's Robert Bissundat and Victoria Kotsiyuba. Hi, my name is Mr. Lana, and I will present the Spanish Language and Culture Bilingual Awards. The recipients are for the Spanish Language and Culture 10, Kuslin, Kur, Mateo, Aro, Spanish Language Culture 20, Amelia Flaherty and Aileen Alferez, Spanish Language and Culture 30, Kate Mendoza and Brian Burgess, and Spanish Language Arts 10, Bilingual Class, Rebecca Leichels and Dana Uribe Velázquez, for Spanish Language Arts 20, Adamaris Cabrera and Guadalupe Lulo Arciga. For Spanish language 30, Elena Slider and Daria Krilova. My it. name is Ms. Dumic and I would like to present the Polish awards. The recipients are Polish 25, Jakub Kozubski, Polish 35, Jakub Cebula and Nicole Tomaszek. Congratulations. My name is Mr. Zamiuski and I will present the Ukrainian language awards the recipients for Ukrainian Language Arts 10, Solomia Mitz. Language Arts 20, Anastasia Harahuts. Ukrainian Language Arts 30, Taisia Baraska. Congratulations to all recipients and thank you to the Modern Language Teachers for presenting. Next, we have the Career and Technology Studies Awards. As there are quite a few CTS awards, we'll break them into smaller groups. My name is Mr. Sermon and I will be presenting the following awards. Design Studies 10, Ashton said. Design Studies 20, Christian Renegar. Design Studies 20, Graham Baker Henderson. Design Studies 30, Haley Cronin. For Outdoor Ed, we have Outdoor Experiences, 10, Moses Nagundu. For Outdoor Survival, we have Brianne Kopchia. And for Hunting and Fishing Education, Grayson Krauss. Thank you to all those award winners. Congratulations. My name is Mr. Pundick and I will present the Construction Fabrication Awards. Construction Fabrication 10, Micah Nero. Construction Fabrication 20, Colby Barrow McNeil. And Construction Fabrication 30, Jackson Parker. Congratulations on your awards. My name is Ms. Tanti and I'll present the following awards. Fashion Studies 10, Brianne Kopcha and Jada Takahapi. Fashion 20, Justine Bonabara and Ocean Kanahessian. Fontaine. Fashion Studies 30, Bartok Churchill. Foods 10, Savannah Tessame. Selena Foods 20, Selena Fernandez. Foods 30, Lorelei Rod Rodriguez. Foods 30, Chelsea Umali. Congratulations on your Foods and Fashion Awards. My name is Mr. McPherson and I will present the Computer Science Principles AP Awards. The recipients are Christian Sabula, and Fam Tran. Congratulations. The Faith in Action Awards are presented to students who hold high averages in Religion 15, 25, and 35. The recipients for this year are in Religion 15, Rebecca Lechet, uh, Religion 25, Simon Zaharjevsky, and Religion 35, Irina Vasulik. Religion of the World 35 will go to Estelle Steffner. Congratulations to all our award recipients. Hi, the next section that we're going to be presenting is for the fine arts with art, music and drama. So I will present the art awards. The Art 10 Award goes to Tina Fan. The Art 20 Award is going to Mariana Hernandez Guerrero. The Art 30 Award is going to Justine May Bonabra. The Passionate Eye Award goes to our wonderful Emily Fleck. 
followed by Annika Bachinski, who's going to receive the Professional Art Creations Award. Thank you. My name is Mr. Kufajanakis, and I will now present the Music Awards. Instrumental Music 10 Award goes to Ryan Winter. The Instrumental Music 20 Award goes to Joan Pendagrosa. And the Instrumental Music 30 Award goes to Ryan Reichsen. Thanks, you guys. Wonderful work this year. Instrumental Jazz 10 goes to Kira Streslik. Instrumental Jazz 20 goes to Jack Letwin. And Instrumental Jazz 30 Award goes to Jack Wiley. Amazing work. Now for the Rock and Roll Awards. Our Rock and Pop 10 goes to Madison Perez. What a great job this year, Madison. Rock and Pop 20 goes to Jack Letwin. And the Rock and Roll Master in Rock and Pop 30 goes to Lucas Jedzwich. Man, you guys were so good this year. Awesome job, everybody. Now the Guitar Awards, Guitar 10. Our award goes to Mary Ann Hope Chomiak. Good job, Mary. That was wonderful. Guitar 20 goes to Ian Massa. Ian, you and Spidey. That was very, very cool. And Guitar 30, the award goes to Genevieve Asselin. Way to go, Genevieve. That was really, really fun. Thanks, you guys, for all of your amazing work. Now, for the other music awards, uh, let's see. Outstanding Instrumentalist, dun dun dun, goes to two people, Alexis Bannock and Ethan Coombe. Wow, you guys were fantastic in class, good job. And what a year we had, eh? Man, it was crazy. Director's Award, now this is someone who's always there to help and who's just, they go the extra mile to be there for the program and for all the work that we're doing around the class. Those awards go to Sarah Clark and Jack Wiley. Thanks, you guys. You did some amazing work this year, and you made everything that we did possible. So thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, the outstanding performance in jazz goes to <laughs> Lucas Jadwich and Julian Jedrich. Man, you guys are part of a killer rhythm section. Amazing work this year. This year. That was really, really fun. All right, outstanding vocalist. We had many vocalists this year that did some pretty darn cool work. Well, the award goes to Ryan Reichsen and Sarah Clark. Thanks, you guys, for all of your work. And everybody in the music program, thank you for your effort, focus, and your incredible hard work because that's what kept the program going and it allowed us to uh, have some pretty amazing musical moments this year. So thank you so much. Hi, I'm Mrs. Kenny, and I will now present the Drama Awards. For Drama 10, Emma Brighton. Drama 20, Shanthony Balasubramanian. Drama 30, Ryan Reichson. And for Film Appreciation, Joey Free. Excellence in Tech Theater, Megan Hillaby. Most Outstanding Drama Student, Kyle Petruk and most outstanding fine arts, for all of the fine arts, Jacelyn Hutchison. Thank you to the fine arts teachers and congratulations to all of the recipients. My name is Ms. Fleming. I will present the Female Phys Ed Awards. Phys Ed 10, Estelle Steffner. Phys Ed 20, Selena Simao. Phys Ed 30, Robin Alexandruk. Hi, my name is Mr. Zort, and I will present the Male Physical Education Awards. The awards are as follows. Physical Education 10, Jake Malkovich. Physical Education 20, Nathan Scales. Physical Education 30, Andre Catoli. My name is Mrs. Riley, and I will present the Sports Performance Awards. The awards are as follows. Sports Performance 10, Mateo Harrow. Sports Performance 20, Marina Samao. Sports Performance 30, Arden Kasuba and Elizabeth McCarthy. Sports Medicine 30, Lukian Podilski. Congratulations. Hi, I'm Mr. Zwart. This year, the Southside Athletic Club alumni has awarded two scholarships to two of our students. The alumni scholarship is committed to assisting student athletes as they pursue their education while participating in sport. 
these two students will receive a $1,000 scholarship, which will go towards their post-secondary education. The two winners are Ostap Krenitske and Ethan Warner. Congratulations to all recipients. My name is Mrs. Lang, and I will now present the For the Love of Dance Awards. The awards are as follows. Dance 15, Peyton Spencer. Dance 25, Caitlin McDonald. Dance 35, Michaela Pucci. Congratulations, girls. My name is Miss Fedor, and I will now present the Mind, Body, Soul Yoga Awards. The awards are as follows. Yoga 15, Emma Park. Yoga 25, Amelia Tessier. Yoga 35, Juliana Wilson. Congratulations. My name is Mrs. Page, and I would now like to present the Major Service Awards. These awards are given to those students who have shown outstanding achievement in school service over their high school careers. Some of their commitments include student leadership, yearbook, concert band, school plays, tech squad, and grad council. Um, so I'd like to congratulate the following winners. Victoria Chervak, Sarah Clark, Haley Cronin, Haven Edwards, Elise Hoff, Taryn Hoshko, Benjamin Kowalski, Daria Krolova, Jenna Lawyer, Elias Makino, Jada Nguyen, Shannon Reschke, Kira Rosser, Elena Schneider, and Jamie Van Dyke, and Thomas Wentz. Thank you for all your service in the last three years at AOB. My name is Mr. Zaharko, and I'll present the David Williams Mentorship Award on behalf of the Williams family. Mr. Williams has been a leader, a mentor, and an active volunteer in our community for many years. The Dave Williams Mentorship Award serves to recognize the most outstanding mentor of the Big Brothers Big Sisters. This year's recipient was an outstanding Big Brother Big Sister mentor throughout her time in high school. We would like to take a moment to recognize this year's award winner for her significant contribution to this program to the end to the lives of those that needed her. The recipient of the Dave Williams Mentorship Award for the 2020-2021 is Justine May Bonalbra. Congratulations, Justine May, on all the best to you in your future. My name is Mrs. Page, and I will now present the Edmonton Strathcona Youth Leadership Award. The purpose of this award is to provide annual recognition of a student who is completing his or her schooling with excellent academic standings and has proven to be a leader both academically and, at, in, and in at least two other fields of endeavor. This student is an outstanding citizen who has contributed to school life here at Austin O'Brien. This student was a contributing member in both the school and greater community for the past three years. This year's Edmonton Strathcona Youth Leadership Award goes to Katie Pelche. Congratulations, Katie. My name is Ignacio Ado, and I will now present the Campbell Family Scholarship. Mr. Ray Campbell was a principal here at Austin O'Brien from 1971 to 1986. Mr. Campbell believed that the three years spent in high school were the most important years for students to mature in wisdom and grace. Academic success depends on using all your talents and dedication. The Campbell Family Scholarship is given to two grade 12 students, one female and one male. These students have the highest combined average in Social Studies 30 and English 30. Students also must be attending post-secondary. The recipients of the Campbell Family Scholarships are Robert Bisundat and Irena Vasluk. Thank you to the Campbell family for your generous donation and congratulations to Robert and Irena. My name is Mrs. Gomez and at AOB, we are proud to present the Crusader Service Award. This Crusader Service Award was named after Sir Austin O'Brien, who was the superintendent of Edmonton Catholic Schools from 1924 to 1961. It is awarded to the student who contributed to our school atmosphere the most over the last three years. This year, the recipient of the Crusader Service Award goes to Daria Krulova. Congratulations, Daria. Next, we will present the Win and Generations Awards of Excellence. The Win and Generations Award of Excellence are given to students who showed an excellent attitude, effort, and performance at their work site. 
The individuals have positive attitudes, were cooperative students at school, and had excellent attendance. As well, these students were good citizens and helped others. The winner of the Win 3 award is Sean Nika. Hi, I'm here to present the Win 2 award to Brayden Hollett. Hi, I'm Oksana Zmiowski, and I am presenting the Generations Award to Raya El Bustani. Hi, I'm Miss Kimmick, and I'm happy to present the Generations Award to Alexander Deshane. Congratulations. Perfect. My name is Mrs. Smith, and I will now present the Bergevin Award. This award is named after Jason Bergevin. Jason entered Austin O'Brien in September 1993. Although limited academically, Jason was very successful in many areas of our program, especially work-study. Upon graduation in 1997, Jason was diagnosed with a brain tumor. After a brave and courageous battle, Jason passed away August 30th, 1998. This award is a tribute to Jason's love of life and quiet determination to succeed at whatever he attempted. The recipient of this award exemplifies the same qualities. The recipient of the Bergevin Award for 2020-2021 is Gustavo Guzman Vasquez. My name is Mr. Pundik and I will now present the Merit Contractors Association CTS Construction Award. The Merit Contractors Association is an organization of non-union construction industry employees who have joined together to provide services and programs to benefit their employees and to enhance business. This award is meant to encourage excellence in construction-related courses offered in Alberta high schools. The individual must also demonstrate leadership qualities in the classroom and show a high level of cooperation with teachers and students alike. The recipient of the Merit Contractors Award is Shannon Reschke. Shannon, congratulations. Okay, so the CanDo Spirit Scholarship goes to a student exemplifying the six characteristics of CanDo's company culture, including leadership, determination, work ethic, taking risks, business with integrity, empowering leaders, ownership, and entrepreneurship. This year's award for the CanDo Scholarship is Daniel Kitze. Congratulations, Daniel. Okay, so the Rotary Scholarship goes to an all-around achiever who demonstrates leadership and school community involvement. This is a $1,000 scholarship, and this year the award winner is Sarah Clark. Congratulations, Sarah. Okay, so this year's award winner for the Florence Taylor Scholarship goes to Sarah Clark. The Florence Taylor Scholarship is awarded to a female student who has overcome many of life's challenges. Congratulations, Sarah. Next, we have the Salute to Youth. Each year, the Kinsman Club of Edmonton is pleased to provide scholarships to a, to a grade 12 student in every Edmonton public and Edmonton Catholic school in the city of Edmonton to recognize the student's contributions to community service. The recipient of this award is Haven Edwards. Congratulations, Haven. Hi, my name is Mr. K, and I will now present the Austin O'Brien High School Rick Michelin Monsignor Fee Otterson Music Performing Arts Legacy Award. The winners of this award have supported and participated in the various components of the Music Performing Arts program. As well, they have willingly moved beyond the formal requirements of the program to participate in other school and district activities as well. Also, they displayed an enthusiastic, cooperative attitude with a keen interest in developing and sharing their skills. These individuals also had a strong school spirit and took responsibility to contribute to its development. The recipients of this award go to Alexander Arabsky and Lucas Jadzowitz. Both Alex and Lucas are outstanding students and truly wonderful people. They approach every single day with a positive spirit and the will to make everyone's life around them better. They possess the rare combination of intensity and drive, along with an infectious lightheartedness and sense of fun. They bring a caring and sense of community that makes each day for all of us in the music program a pleasure to be a part of. Congratulations, Alex and Lucas, and thank you for all the wonderful work you have done for our school community. Congratulations. My name is Mr. Zaharko. And we would now like to send our appreciation to the amazing Austin O'Brien custodial staff. The recipients of this award are not students at Austin O'Brien, but in fact staff. These hardworking people work diligently to ensure our school is clean and welcoming. 
their constant the constant dedication and commitment to, is greatly appreciated. The recipients we are referring to are Mr. Ni Tan Nguyen, who has served the district for 39 years. Mr. Ramesh Kumar, who has served the division for 27 years. And Mr. Hanok Zion, who has served the district for 15 years. We are extremely fortunate to have such a dedicated, helpful team. Thank you again to our custodial staff for all their hard work. My name is Ignacio Aro, and I will now present the Premier Citizenship Award. This award is given to one graduating student from each high school in Alberta to recognize outstanding achievements in citizenship, leadership, community service, and volunteer work. Throughout high school, her academic standing remained outstanding. The recipient of the 2020-21 Premier Citizen Award is Sarah Clark. Congratulations, Sarah. My name is Dr. Coates, and I would like to present the Most Outstanding Students Award for the 2020-21 school year. This award is presented to students who have achieved academic success, have provided service to the school, and who have participated in school activities. These students have been contributing members to both our school and to the greater community for the past three years. Throughout high school, they have excelled academically and have been active volunteers in the school and community. They have maintained high academic averages over their three years here at AOB. We are pleased to announce the most outstanding students of the 2020-2021 school year, which go to Kara Rosser, McKenna Warwa. Congratulations, Kira and McKenna. Each year, with the Superintendent's Awards of Excellence, Edmonton Catholic Schools honors junior and senior high students who, through their daily lift actions, demonstrate excellence. The recipients are determined by the school community that they attend. The principal, in consultation with staff, will make the selection of the recipients for their school. The following are the criteria for this award. Any student whose behavior has exemplified in an extraordinary way the core values of the Edmonton Catholic School Division. Any student who exhibits outstanding leadership skills and who uses their ability to benefit others. Any student who has shown strength to overcome obstacles in their life and has persevered in overcoming these obstacles. Any student who has shown extraordinary effort to foster a positive quality of life within the school community. Any student who has contributed to an outstanding, in an outstanding manner to the community beyond the school environment. We are pleased to announce the Superintendent's Awards of Excellence for the 2020-21 school year, which go to Osean Kahanishan Fontaine and Alexis Bannock. Oseyan is an exceptional student who consistently seeks to get involved in meaningful ways. Oseyan has high expectations for herself and works hard to set reasonable expectations and to show herself grace. Oseyan is academically gifted and is also involved in multiple activities that contribute to the school community and well-being of others. Oseyan is especially passionate about Indigenous culture and social justice. She is an enthusiastic member of our Braided Journeys program. She takes part in beading, traditional dance, and the weekly smudge ceremony. She is considered a strong ally, ally to the Indigenous community who advocates for equality, justice, and who uses her voice to strengthen the voice of others. Most of all, I would like to recognize Oseyan's potential with her empathetic heart and passion for helping others. Her contributions will be profound in high school, post-secondary and beyond. This nomination is a show of encouragement to Oseyan that she is undoubtedly on the right track and can trust the journey ahead. Our next individual is Alexis Bannock. 
she moved to Edmonton at the beginning of grade 10. She and her family experienced many challenges during this move, but have overcome them to be successful. Alexis sought extra help from her teachers, put in hours of studying and achieved honors. She joined the drama club and concert ensemble in grades 10 and 11. She applied for the Wises Summer Research Program and made it all the way to the shortlist. During remote learning, Alexis kept up with all her classes and successfully wrote the AP Biology exam during the lockdown. Alexis is now doing commissioned artwork as a way to earn money. She has applied for, for the neuroscience program at UBC. Congratulations, Osean and Alexis. This concludes our 2020-21 awards celebration. We thank you so much for coming to Austin O'Brien's awards event. Congratulations to all award recipients. Please have a great night, a restful and relaxing summer.